Hello everybody, welcome back. I'm back again. I'm making another 80 by 30 centimetre piece today. It's the canvas. I've put a little bit of foam into the back of this canvas. It was a clock face that I bought really cheap and discovered it was foam. I've put the keys in the back. I've tautened it with water this time. All of the grey that I'm using is old grey from my previous piece. You'll have seen if you've watched the video, I put a lot of paint off onto the surface. Here it is. I've got a really, really nice dark grey. It's got all of the metallic pigments in it. It's a mixture of everything from the previous pour. Scraped up, sieved through a pair of tights, and a small amount of black added to this one. And here's more of it. Sieved through the tights, and some white added to this one. Now, my paint is thick enough that the stair will stand up in it, and it'll leave small raised area as the paint dribbles into the cup you can see a slight mound that then settles that's a great consistency again here this is a whole cup of deep red by Crawford and Black fairly thick the stick will stand up in it the greys that I mentioned have probably got some silicon in them so hopefully that's not going to go against me when I'm pouring this out and do loads of ugly things Hopefully not, but that's what we've got, that's what we're going with. The black is Acado's Fluid Acrylic. Pretty nice. And then we have gold. This gold is a mixture of a non-branded copper and a non-branded gold. I haven't put any additional pigments into this. <laughs> it's just as it comes. Two of them added together. The recipe that I'm working to today is one part acrylic paint, one part Liquitex pouring medium and between one and two parts of water. I'm going to move the camera straight down. Now then, I'm going to go about pouring this a fairly particular way so that my colours don't mingle. And I'll be pouring it out of the same side that the colours go into. So I'll start straight away with the nice dark grey. Okie dokie, I'm just bobbing back with a really quick snippet to show you how this paint has dried. It's been over a week and it's come up really nicely. We've got some really nice gold here that shimmer through and catch all of these beautiful stripe details. You see that here? I love it, I think it'll pop up so bright and vibrant and really crisp across this area with a lovely coat of varnish oh, a good few coats of varnish or my usual preference of a resin flood coat 
we'll see there we have it though hope you've enjoyed watching this video thank you please subs <laughs> thank you for watching and please subscribe to my channel take care until next time